What's going on YouTube? It's the Trolla Bully back today, and today we are opening up this Arceus Collector's Chest. Before we get into it, I just want to remind you all of our 250 subscriber giveaway. So once we hit 250 subscribers, I will be giving away this Gyarados GX Gem Mint 10 Pokemon card to one of you guys. This is a very clean card, and the Gyarados art is absolutely stunning. So, keep up the great support. We're almost there. We are so close, and I cannot wait to give away one of those to you guys. So, before we break into this thing, I just want to take a minute to look at the art, because I think it is a very cool design. I like how they did the three starters and kind of contrasting colors, and then obviously Arceus on the other side can't beat that. So, in this video, I'm just going to kind of go through it, open it up, uh, give you all my thoughts on the product let's see what's inside pretty much just give like an honest review of is this pokemon product worth it or not now it is thirty dollars so it's 29.99 and as you can see it's is a very cool box as it opens up just like that and here we have our promos so at first i just want to say that coin is Definitely the coolest coin I have seen. As you can see, the white sparkles and glitter. Without a doubt, the coolest coin I've seen. And one that I will actually probably put on my shelf. Now, as far as the promo cards. There's Relit, Oshawott, and Cyndaquil. So, let's see how these look. All right, so there you can see the Cyndaquil, very cute. The Oshwat, and come on now, the Rowlet. Which I think these designs are pretty cute. Like the three arts and the hollows are really nice on them. It's not the choppy hollow, they're all one pattern, which I really do enjoy. So let's put those three to the side and see what else we got in here. Alright, so here is how the packs come. Comes So we have one, two, three Vivid Voltage. One, two Brilliant Stars. Oh, there's our code card. So there is the code card for one of you all. One Fusion Strike and one Evolving Skies. So then, just take out this plastic piece, and it looks like, yeah, you have some stickers of each starter. I know my girlfriend is going to have a blast with that. It looks like this is just a notepad of some sort. Yeah, just a notepad, so cool design on that. And it's actually textured, so running my hands on it, I don't, yeah, you can actually see it in the camera. It's actually textured, which is a very nice feel to it. And then, can't get the other two out, there is the other two sheets of stickers. So, you do get a lot with this product. Uh, you get the coin, you get the three promos, you get seven booster packs, you get a, you get a lot of stickers, a notebook. Um, so, retailing for about $29.99. Uh, let's see, so seven packs, you're looking at like roughly four dollars a pack, so that's, yeah, about 28, uh, let's just say two dollars for the coin and the three promos, and you have your money back, not to mention the booklet and the stickers. So I do feel like they put in enough product inside this thing to warrant that... $29.99 MSRP asking price. Personally, I do think that they added enough in here. Um, interesting thoughts to me so far. As we get started, Primate Semipore is I wonder why they decided to go with three Vivid Voltage as the pack choices. I wish they would have included more Brilliant Stars, considering that is the newest set. And a Chandelure V. Very nice. Anytime you can get a hit at a Fusion Strike, 
you just kind of count your blessings that it's not the easiest set to get hits out of so thankful to hit something out of there but yeah i don't know why they chose three vivid voltage as the card choices for this set um i would have liked to have seen uh brilliant stars as it's the newest set and coolest but you know i will definitely take three vivid voltage over say three battle styles or three fusion strikes or something like that so that's my biggest gripe with some of the other new products that they came out with like the pikachu v box and the uh, lucario is i feel like they just dumped a ton of fusion strike in it that wasn't really necessary and i don't really like Ooh, very nice charizard reverse if you're going to hit a reverse charizard is the one to hit so I will actually set this card over here as well. But yeah, so like as far as the Lucario box goes that just came out and the Pikachu V box, I mean half the cards or half the entire pack in there is just nothing but Fusion Strike. And that just kind of, I mean I don't really like that because A, Fusion Strike isn't the best of sets. It's not terrible. It does have some nice hit and chase cards in it. But I would have much rather have seen a Vivid Voltage or Brilliant Stars especially or evolving skies or personally even a chilling rain as i do love chilling rain but that's just my personal opinion uh some of you all may love fusion strike and you may be happy that you can get a lot of packs and alcremi so some of you may enjoy getting all the fusion strike packs and these new products but personally i don't all right, so here comes our last pack of Vivid Voltage. Let's hope we can pull a Chonky Pikachu, as that would be amazing. One, two, three, and four to the front. So, Energy, Quark, Crack, Wyndham Stadium, Rocky Helmet, Nkeda, Wismer, Drober, Welmer, Katani. Milkery Reverse and a Fortress. So our three Vivid Voltage packs were not kind to us other than that Reverse Charizard. Um, now let's go into Evolving Skies. And I mean, all it takes is one pack out of this set. Man, you, you are you guys already know. All it takes is one pack. All it takes is one card magic. And you can pull some absolute insane cards. Cards. I believe the Umbreon alt art is going for about $375 near mint right now on TCG Player, which is just absolute craziness. Hippopotas, Zoru, a Psyduck, a Reverse Victini, and a Seismitoad. So we have not had the best of pulls out of these, out of this box. I mean, we have the Chandelure and the Charizard Reverse, but other than that, we have nothing. So, let's hope Brilliant Stars can be kind to us. Show us show us some love. One, two, three, and four to the front. Alright, so there is Energy, Ultra Ball, Tropius, Claydol, Bidoof, Electabuzz, Halucha, Buzil, a Gibble, a Weavile Reverse, and a Wormadam. So, again, not a great pack. And we are down to our last one. Let's hope we can get some last pack magic as we desperately need it. Let's see here. There's your code card. Let's do one, two, three, and four to the front. All right. So energy, choice belt, Vibrava, Staravia, Golet, Cast Form, Chimchar, Baltoy, Axio, a Magmar Reverse. And a Shaman V Full Art. Very cool. 
So, our hits weren't the greatest, but we did pull the full art of V and a Charizard reverse. So, not the worst possible. So, just to give you my final thoughts on this, as you watch me struggle to put this card in the sleeve. Is this product worth it? My honest review, I would say yes, personally. Because, I mean, honestly, the packs alone equal the $30 value that you get from... Because, I mean, some of those packs are only worth, like, $3.50, but some of them are also worth over $4, like the Brilliant Stars and the Evolving Skies. So, to get the seven packs, I do feel like that's worth the $30. Uh, the seven packs, the coin... Again, I'll show that because it is very, very cool. And the three promos, along with the stickers, the notebooks, and everything. I, just, I feel like this product is definitely worth it. I definitely feel like you get your bang for your buck. Um, my personal opinion, this is better than the Lucario box, who has three Fusion Strike packs in it. Not a fan of that. And it's also better than the Morpego V box, V Union box. Just This is my personal opinion. If you guys disagree, let me know in the comments. Um... Yeah, this is my opinion. This box is definitely worth it. It is my favorite of the new boxes. I like it more than the Pikachu V box, the Lucario V box, and the Morpeko V Union. So, it look for this on your guys' shelves, and if you decide to rip it, let me know if you get any hits. A uh, quick reminder about our giveaway that's going on. So, as soon as we hit 250 subs, we will be giving away that Gyarados slab that I showed earlier. And if you enjoy this type of content, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.